please get your welcome. <laughs> say to your dialect, say to your language, please. Just tell me and welcome your dialect, please. Huh? I am? <laughs> it's good to be back. Thank you. Good evening. How's it going? So, this is the second edition of Icon Awards and uh, I am back here again. And indeed, um, I hear there are plans in the offering to make me a citizen. Is that also Humphrey? Yeah. Uh, give me some chieftaincy title and settle me down in one of the, uh, the villages and stuff like that. So yes, um, um, very soon you guys are going to be allotted to let you know that I'm going to be a dual citizen of Uganda. It's a joke. But I know you want me to be a citizen, right? I'll take that home, I'll take it home. Alright, um, so far so good. My first time in Uganda was last year for the Icon Awards and it was a lovely time. I met with a few colleagues that also had been to Nigeria for some of the awards, but it was my first time meeting Humphrey, the organizer of this award, and we clicked. Uh, myself and my partner and Humphrey, and we decided to talk a little more about partnership and how to push um, ourselves into doing some good content, meaning Nigeria and Uganda. And a year has passed now, and while we were at it, we were thinking and just you know, stewing on it to know when exactly and what we have, how we can actually create content as befitting for the taste board of Ugandans and Nigeria. And we have finally come to the conclusion that uh, we are going to do some this year. With that being said, I am so, so proud of the Honorable Minister for announcing those policies. If Madam, if you might. Honorable Betty, can you please step on stage, please, and help me present this award, this next award. The policies that she just talked about, for instance, the IP, intellectual property, that is big. That is something really, really big, and every creative mind deserves. Please, a round of applause for us, please, on stage. Producer? Or we should just open and announce? Yes? I, I, I think first to say the African Icon Award is for extraordinary Africa with extraordinary accomplishments that has worked hard, climbed the ladder, and done us proud. So, should we open? Uganda, there is a Nigeria, there is a Kenya, there is South Africa, and the word goes to Nancy Isime. Such a deep, profound honor for me. Um, 
the industry here, the movie industry here, is quite impressive with amazing work. I'm really proud of the industry. Please. You can go ahead and clap. <laughs> I'm really proud. And I remember speaking recently and I was, you know, telling someone, I'm sorry, how many more seconds do I have? Five more seconds. Okay, I'll rush this up. And I was telling someone that instead of us always looking forward to going to the Oscars, the Globes, and all of those um, um, awards organized by Westerners, we actually should be proud of our own awards. We should be able to integrate Nigeria and the rest of Africa together. We should be able to be proud of our own. And I really want to give a big props to Mr. Humphrey for bringing this up. This is the second edition, but it beats my imagination and it's fantastic. So thank you so much. And thank you for having me. Have a wonderful night. Glory to God and my team. Um, isn't she wonderful? Look at the costume, it's very African. I got this made by Larry Cajon here in just one night. A round of applause. Thank you guys. Thank you so much. Icon Awards. Thank you, Uganda. Thank you, Africa. My Uganda creatives, I just have one word for you. Just keep pushing. Keep knocking on that door until it's open for you. God bless you all.